Now, the man who's confessed to killing 76 people in a rampage in Norway may be charged with crimes against humanity. 32-year-old Anders Breivik has already been charged in court with terrorism, which he denies. The bombing of government buildings in central Oslo and massacre at an island youth camp last Friday devastated the nation. A hundred thousand people gathered in the capital meantime in tribute to the victims. Breivik says he targeted uh, Norway's leading party for failing on immigration. But crisis analysts say multiculturalism is a reality we all have to accept, even though more pain will come. I think Europe and the world at large, to, to its credit, has gone from an assimilationist mindset to a multiculturalist mindset. And I think now we have to go to what I would call a metacultural mindset. We all need to embrace the idea that there is no, there should no longer be separate cultures. We are merging into a global culture, which is going to require change from both immigrants and native born people living in quote unquote their own countries. We, this, this synthesis of cultures is going to be a net positive for all of us. But unfortunately, the, the frictions early on are going to be difficult as we're seeing with the Brevik tragedy.